you're looking for the latest and the greatest Nespresso coffee machines, you're in SM Visions. This is the Nespresso Sage Uno coffee machine. Brand new, comes in this matte black and gray all the way through. So gray on the middle and matte black on the side to give you a superb look and a nice uniform finish. So it's got the Sage logo here. You can see that all the milk fluffer. All you do is lift it to fluff your milk. It's a nice design to it. Drip tray is just here. This is for your cups. So if you've got a smaller cup, that will sit on there and your coffee will come down onto your cup. Bigger cups will be sitting on this surface. You push here and that is all the pods will go in here when you do want to empty it. So a nice simple design and the tray comes in and out when you do want to have all the filled water that will go in here and you can empty that nice and easily and it's a design if you've seen the Creatista before on this channel you know what to expect but this is the Uno number one in grey and black finish so I have to say it's, I do like the design of it it's a uniform finish shiny on the side and brushed on grey finish here, it's like a more of a grey finish. If you look on the side, it's shiny. Let's go around and I hope you can see that. It's all shiny finish here and on the back, that's where all the water goes in and then we just lift that out. So it's very simple to manoeuvre. To take out the water, you basically lift this out and fill it onto your tap or your sink lid comes off as you can see back on and you put it on your water's filled up pop it back in and you can always fill it up when it's on there so put the lid down if you want to go to the sink you can or use a jug it's all up to you as you can see it's a shiny finish superb design i really really like this uniform black design and everything and the main difference is on top Let's show you that. So when we travel to the top, it's all button configuration, so it's not all digital as other creators, the steel for this, the gold and everything. So you choose the size of your cup from here and you choose the degree of heat you like. If you do want to froth milk and if you want to let, you want to clean it or basically let steam come out of here so when you're frothing and everything so cups are small medium and large depending on what size coffee you mean uh, when you're descaling this will light up and when you're cleaning this will light up as well and as usual the pods go in here and espresso pods you can buy compatible ones but they say you will avoid the guarantee if you put that in so the pods go in here and you're ready to go simple design so it's a more of a simple version of the creatista you choose the size of your cup and it's quite tactile I like these buttons it's nice and smooth not too thick not pointing out it's a uniform finish and it looks great I like the Creatista from the start and this is, makes it more simple and much better and it's a sleek finish hopefully they'll do it in other colors plastic finish if you have enjoyed this episode give it a thumbs up and give it a thumbs down if you haven't let me know what you think of the Creatista Uno if you're gonna buy something like this or you're not even thinking about anything like this thank you for watching thank you for listening hope to see you again bye bye